still in the soft opening stage of travel. A lot of flights have the potential to be canceled. We regret to inform you that your flight from Toronto to Calgary has been canceled due to the impacts of COVID-19. More and more people are ready to risk flying longer distances to spend time with loved ones during the holidays. But experts say travel restrictions for both domestic and international are making it difficult to plan. Sudden schedule shifts and outright cancellations of flights becoming the new normal for travelers. A lot of flights have the potential to be canceled. That disrupts a lot of people's plans. Joe Pavelka with Mount Royal University says many Canadians spend the summer traveling by car and now some are ready to go by air. But with entry restrictions varying between countries and between provinces, travel has remained low, causing more flight cancellations. The airlines uh, kind of gambled that by now there would be, uh, I guess you could say, a sufficient control of the COVID-19 that air traffic would take off again. So they expanded their schedule. Barry Prentice, a professor at the University of Manitoba, says the aviation and travel industry relies heavily on demand. With fewer people flying domestically and internationally, airlines have had to condense flights. And as long as you have quarantines and restrictions on, on crossing borders, it's impossible for the airlines to, to survive. In an email to City News, WestJet says they've reduced operations by 75% compared to last year and have been forced to suspend the vast majority of flights because of the pandemic. Air Canada telling City News their schedule was reduced by up to 90%. Everybody in aviation and all related tourists and travel is hurting and this is going to carry on until we get a vaccine. But Pavelka says it shouldn't discourage people from booking their trip home for the holidays. If anything, he advises to book early and to book now, but also be open to potential changes. The more people book in the last minute, the more likely it is that things are not going to run because it's just too difficult for the airline industry to ramp up that quickly. The more we make plans, the better it is going to be for the overall industry. In Calgary, Jackie Perez, City News.